Well, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, my friends, all across the globe today, and welcome. We finally have news! Yes, so the European pack was just revealed. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff to talk about in here. So obviously, we can already see a lot of stuff come into play here. We see the Fire Salamander, we see the Alpine Ibex, we see the beautiful little Ibex. Not Ibex, that's a Lynx. What the hell am I talking about? But we still don't know what that very last soft brown creature is. So that's going to be a little bit of a thing to look into. But this is absolutely amazing. So we could already see so many new pieces come into play here. We see this small little pedestrian bridge, which is really going to be awesome to see how that works out. I can't wait to see what pieces we're actually going to be able to use in here. And we do have the gondola supports. So these are very much on brand with the ones that we found within the files. So it's going to be really awesome to see what gets taken in, what gets, you know, kind of left behind. I can't wait to see the uses for all of these. So this may very well be a new tour boat. I'm not sure. It very well may be like, you know, its own standalone scenery piece, which I wouldn't really mind. But we have a lot of different, you know, architectural styles in here. These are all very Dutch right over there. We see like the Italian, uh you know, Italian coastal side from like Venice right over there. I'm sorry guys, I'm so excited about this. But we can see so many different things. We have the neon signs which are going to be very useful. It's going to be very fun to integrate those within the park. So I think these over here may actually be the badger. It's kind of hard to kind of tell because, you know, it's just a sign and we can't actually see the animal in there but i would say that's a hard read as a badger in fact we could kind of see peeking over right over the distance over here this is all actually going to be what seems to be kind of you know a new building set yes new building set with new rock work kind of stuff like that that's going to be really cool to see i think these are actually new paths so if i'm not mistaken these are actually from planet coaster and i think these are the supports as well so this is very sleek very modern i'm going to use all of these in all my zoos going forward this just it fits the zoo vibe zoo vibe so well and we can see how well it meshes with that classic theme that planet zoo does have and just all of this makes me so happy. Here's the cantilever bridge, which we talked about way before. I can really, like, appreciate how beautiful this is going to be. I think it's just going to act as a scenery piece, which is a little unfortunate, but I don't really mind. We can also see the beautiful new flags and, you know, representations for the animals over here. Well, I do think that, you know, this European theme is a little bit too heavy-handed. I think it's going to come out extremely well in the end. We can even see the fire salamander over here playing the little instruments that's gonna be really cute oh my gosh now we have all these beautiful things over here we do see the deer statue right down there so i don't think that we will be getting a deer in this pack i'm sorry to say i would have appreciated a deer but i think it's fine without it that's something right new right over there i think we may be getting like new shop shells kind of like cars so i think those are the coaches that we found in the files as well that's gonna be really cool and look at these new lights. This is going to be absolutely beautiful to have. Everything in here is just so shockingly beautiful. And we even get new, like, canvas right over here. Guys, I'm so excited. I know this is very hyper-themed, but I'm very excited for it nonetheless. We see the links over here. Look at the beautiful fur work on this guy. Oh my gosh. Mayor G, I'm sorry that your links may have to be retired, but this is so beautiful and i am beyond excited for it that kind of looks like saint peter's square or saint mark's square i don't really know i'm not a full-blood italian but guys this is insane so if i actually do pull up this over here and pause the pack from playing we can do we can also see a beautiful shot of the ibex right over here with 250 new scenery pieces guys this is freaking huge i have been wanting new scenery pieces for the longest time and it's finally about time that we get some more. And I think that may be a new pine. I'm not entirely sure. But look at this beautiful map. Oh my gosh. So I'm assuming this is a Switzerland map. And we can see a lot of different like architectural styles be pulled into here. We could see the gondola coming down from there. But we also may have a gondola down there as well. It's going to be really awesome to see. So the buoys, that all matches up. The restaurants, you're going to see a lot of that integrated within the scenario. Of course, it's going to be $10 
hours already. So, you know, keep that in mind if you guys do want to get packs. But don't see the value in an animal pack. You can definitely wait a little bit. But this is going to be absolutely amazing. And this is pretty much all we have. Actually, oh, we have all the animals right here. Eurasian Lynx, Alpine Ibex, European Badger, and the European Fallow Deer. Yeah! So that's actually really exciting because I've been wanting a fallow deer officially for the longest time. And while that is true that I will have to retire the most popular mod on the Nexus right now. And, you know, we can go pay it respects right now. Why not? We can go drop a little coin in its bucket. That is amazing that we'll finally be getting a real deer species. That is going to be really cool. Also, I w just want to talk to whoever said a hot new exhibit animal as a fire salamander. Like, come on. you. Th I'm the bad pun person, but... Unfortunately, this one will have to be retired. That is a little sad because Narwhaler did such a beautiful job on the rework of it. But you know what? Maybe we could rebrand it to the Persian Fallow Deer. Actually, you know what? That's exactly what I'll do after this. But this is going to be absolutely beautiful, guys. I'm already getting so excited about this. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope you guys are all as excited as I am for this wonderful pack. Do keep your eyes posted for videos coming forward. I can't wait to build for all of these creatures. I can't wait to start building them like you know foxborough and everything like that so definitely do keep that in mind and i can't wait to see you guys in the next video take care and have the most wonderful of wonderful days bye bye now